discrepancy relay. In NC code, it is represented as 30x. In 132kb and above voltage level, normally discrepancy type control switch are used in the panel for control circuit breaker. The image shows a discrepancy type control switch. It has subcontacts for closed position and some contacts for open or trip conditions and some for after close and some for after trip condition. It has one bulb or lighting unit and a breaker mechanism that has two latch position staggered by 90 degree angle. Furthermore, this position can be turned in the same direction by 45 degree. However, the switching button must be pressed. If not, the switch will jump back into its 90 degree position. The 90 degree rotary control switch is used for acknowledgement signaling switch and the 45 degree press and twist switch is used for control the circuit breaker. The control discrepancy switch is used to control the CB and to monitor the circuit state in the mimic. When it slides up or illuminated, it indicates that the position of the control discrepancy switch does not match with the state of the circuit breaker. Flashing of the lamp in the discrepancy type control switch, if any discrepancy happen related to the state of the CB and the switch positions. Discrepancy relay circuit has been shown in this figure. It has mainly 5 bus wire coming from the bus coupler or bus transfer panel. One positive bus that is ferrule as L1A, one negative bus, L2A, one steady bus, L53, discrepancy bus, L51, one flasher bus, L55. One flasher relay located in the bus coupler or bus transfer panel. Actually, uh, there exists only one flasher relay in the entire 132 kb or 220 kb systems. Discrepancy relay in each panel. Hmm. If any discrepancy happen with the position of the control switch and the CB state, it will lead to operate the 30 X of the of the panel discrepancy bus will get through positive DC and also flasher relay will energize and that will lead to energize the flasher bus that is continuous on of DC positive will go through the flasher bus wire which will lead to his flashing or blinking of the lamp in the set control suite of the panel the discrepancy circuit after CB trip has been shown in this figure. As previously CB was closed and CB remained in closed position and due to CB trip on fault condition, the discrepancy has been occur through auxiliary contact of CB and discrepancy relay. Therefore, discrepancy bus and flasher bus will be energized as shown in this figure and as a result, there will be continuous blinking of the lamp in the discrepancy switch of this panel. Similarly, after the closing of CB, if we move the switch position to its latch off condition without pressing the switch, the discrepancy will be occur between the state of CV and switch position of CV and thereby it will lead to energize the discrepancy and flasher bus and lead to flashing of the lamp in the control switch as shown in this figure. Again during normal condition if we make the DCS switch in on position the steady bus will energize and lead to on of all the lamp associated with the voltage level of the panels. That's mean for 132 kb system if it had two numbers of transformer HV panel, one number of bus transfer panel, two number of feeder panel by making DCS in on position it will make lamp of all 52 CS or discrepancy switch of all five panels will glow.
friends if you like my videos then please go through my channels and please comment opinion and subscribe thank you